Hi guys, happy Friday Eve. I am getting ready to make myself an adult beverage for the evening and so I thought I would come on and make it with you guys. So I'm making my version of Frosé. So there's no rosé involved in this. I actually, y'all know I love some cheap Aldi wine. So I actually have a sweet pineapple wine that I'm gonna be using. And I also have a sparkling soda that I had left over from when we were gonna drink it for some occasion, but we didn't and we never opened it, so it should still be fizzy. And then I've got a couple of peaches I'm gonna throw in there. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. So I'm actually just gonna start with the bottle of wine. And like I said, it's screw cap wine, y'all. Yeah, it's Aldi. I think these are like <laughs> literally $4 a bottle or something like this. But if I'm making a drink like this or if I'm making some like quick sangria or something like that, I don't need expensive wine to do that. So I'm all about the Aldi wine. So I've just got my stone fruit wedger here and I am going to wedge up a couple of peaches to throw in there as well. Usually when you're making froze, you would add frozen fruit. Um, I don't have any frozen fruit, but I do have fresh fruit, so that's what we're using. And I do have ice, so I'm gonna put ice in there since I don't have frozen fruit. So I'm gonna throw the peaches in. And you don't have to peel the peaches when you're using our deluxe cooking blender. It's going to absolutely puree everything up. So it's, it's not a problem. All right. Peaches going in. And to that, I'm gonna add some of this soda. It is still fizzy, thankfully. It's not been on the shelf so long that it won't be fizzy anymore. So I'll put some of that in there. If I had seltzer or something like that, I probably just would have used plain, but I'm all about using what's on hand. And that's what I have. And then I'm gonna throw in some ice. All right. And that's it. I'm going to actually put it on the smoothie setting of my deluxe cooking blender, which will make it blend for about a minute. And we're gonna see how it looks and go from there. It's gonna get noisy, so I'm gonna stop talking. So I'm going to, yeah, so it's not a completely frozen thing, which is okay. But like I said, I wasn't using frozen fruit. I was just using fresh fruit. And there we go. So you can see it actually, I didn't blend it all the way. So you've still got some pieces of peaches in there, which I do not mind. And yeah. Mm. Delicious. Super quick, super simple. You can make a big batch of this if you're having a party. Um, or you can just go sit on the porch and enjoy it on a hot summer evening, which is what my husband and I are getting ready to do. So we'll see you next time. Thanks guys. Bye.